So this is a very good news for all of you appearing in Gate Psychology 2025 session. If you would have joined on the Telegram channel, you would have known beforehand that the exam date is going to be out soon. The exam dates are out for your Gate Psychology 2025 session. So from where you can check this, you can check this for XH session because it is your XHC5 for the humanities thing. And you can go on the website over here on this website and when you will search where it is the home section you can see over here examination schedule and when you scroll down below you will find the exam date of your gate 2025 examination which is on saturday 15th of february just one day after sternberg's theory of love okay so Saturday 15th of February 2025 in the afternoon session 2.30 to 5.30 p.m. You will be having afternoon session the examination of not EC not GE XH. So this is your XH as apart from this date you will not find anywhere mentioned as XH. So this XH is your exam date. So now be prepared for three months down the line. And then on 15th of February, you will be definitely knowing yourself that you are going to clear gate psychology with a healthy score this time. Why? Because you are following this channel and if you have not yet subscribed, make sure that you do that. So now today is 12th of November and approximately 15th of November from 15th November if we count, we are having approximately 3 months over here. This is 15th of Jan and then 15th of Feb. So in these 3 months, one two and three in these three months you have to prepare very well so that nobody 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 can stop you for clearing this examination in this very particular attempt if you would have been following our videos from previously or from the start the complete preparation guide the description you will also find the link over there so if you missed out on something the benefits the books the pyqs how to do all of those Make sure that you watch all the videos completely so that you can have a better understanding of this particular examination and you can utilize these three months very well so that you don't panic in the month of Jan and Feb. Okay. If you want to clear this examination, it is very simple, very, very simple. You don't need to do any extraordinary thing. You have to be just a normal person with 100 IQ and you will be able to clear this examination very very easily okay and believe me whoever is following this channel properly from the very start they will be definitely clearing 100 percent provided they are doing what has been told in the videos you just need two simple things to do those are what those are the books which you need to refer and second is your pyqs you must have to do all these pyqs if you do these pyqs okay so what to do about these pyqs how you can achieve great success make sure that the psychology portion pretty obviously the complete paper if you solve it is very good for you but as far as psychology is concerned make sure that you solve this psychology paper every time for approximately five times okay so let's suppose there is a paper of 2021 solve the psychology portion five times as long as you are getting full marks on those and without any negative marking Solve again for 2022, solve again for 2023 and solve again 2024, 5, 5 times. So 5, 10, 15 and 20. So 20 times you would have already been studied all those questions, all those paper pattern and nobody is going to stop you on 15th of February 2.30 to 5.30, whatever time it is, to not clear the examination. On 15th, you will be knowing, okay, I am going to clear this examination. I am going to get a healthy score in at least psychology that is 100% sure. Okay, in psychology, you will be getting these good marks definitely if you follow these things and you will be achieving good score. You have to also identify the theme if you are studying on your own. Identify the themes which I have mentioned in the previous PYQ videos that there are simple, simple themes which they are asking again and again. Just like that variable ratio, interval ratio and all those things and like standard deviation. They are asking each and every time how to just remember how to calculate Z score. What is SD, what is variance, what is range, what is central tendency, what is mean median mode, this much will even eventually fetch you two easy marks. If you know this much only, you will get two marks and for the higher studies, you can go with the ANOVA table. How to do that? I have also shown in this video, in this channel particularly, 
how to do ANOVA, how to find DF, degree of freedoms for within, between and all of that. Okay. Make sure that you study ANCOVA and ANOVA this time maybe. Okay. They might ask you about covariance and all of those things. So just be prepared. And from where you have to prepare, the books, links have been given in the description. Everything is in the description if you find it. Just read it very calmly, very easily and very, very, we can say, with a cool mind, if you do all those things, you don't need anyone. You don't need anyone. Just do those things and you will be able to clear this examination on 15th of February itself. You don't even need to wait for the result because you will be knowing that psychology portion you have done superbly, amazingly. And make sure also from the syllabus, you study those topics as well, which have never been asked. Okay. So whatever they are asking, you have to study multiple times, revise more and more as well as those topics which they have never asked because this time they might change your pattern a little bit. Okay. It's just an assumption, just how we do in NPC and all of those things, just an assumption. But they might change little pattern of asking questions. They might include new topics as well because they are also growing as you all growing. Okay. So they are also growing. So they might include new topic as well. Maybe disorders and all those things they might bump back again. So make sure you study all those topics as well. And you don't need to do any extraordinary things, any high five books you don't need to study you just need to study what you need to study necessarily and you need to study AKC. if you do this much line by line it's done it's done you don't need to do anything apart from this just do this thing plus your pyqs you are done don't need to do anything apart from this okay yes if you have done these things multiple times two times three times four times then any exam in india will not stop you by clearing that examination but if you have done these things then you can, can go with refer to other books as well but it is not recommended for this gate examination based on the previous patterns okay so you don't need to go for kaplan as well because they are not asking from this book if you are preparing for udc net then you might give a thought on that but not for this particular examination these two books are more than enough for clearing this time 2025 okay so that was the good news for today make sure that you join the telegram channel if you would have joined the telegram channel you would have known earlier as well that the exam is going to be out the schedule is going to be out so be prepared for the 15th of february 2 30 onwards you are most welcome not am pm and prepare well if you have any doubts regarding this exam preparation you can comment down below and that's all for this video see you all in the next video and all the very best Make sure that you clear this examination in this 2025 attempt only and promise yourself that you will be knowing on 15th of February that you are going to clear the examination. You don't need to even wait for the results. Just do the psychology portion very good and the rest reasoning and comprehension part. If you do average performance in this as well, it's absolutely fine. For that also, you just need to do the PYQs and that's it. See you also in the next video and make sure that in the description you check all the links. Thank you and have a nice day ahead.